lighting candles in their homes Yes, it's Christmas It's a magic time You can feel it in the air That every child got their hearts filled up Hello guys, I am so glad that you clicked on today's video. Thank you so much for clicking on it and coming back to my channel and watching my videos. I really do hope you enjoy the content that I make and I put out for you guys. I enjoy it myself, so I'm hoping you guys do too. Um, but I have so much decor this year that I really went all out. I have never gone all the like done all of this decor ever in I did it this year and I'm super happy that I did so I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you love the decor that I got I am honestly so in love with everything that I have and I hope you guys do too um but uh, sorry I am out of breath now but to start off the morning we just made an alcoholic apple cider and I have actually made this before and I told you guys exactly what I put in it um, and I have made another video about it so if you would like to go to that video to see how I made it I will leave it up in the corner for you guys to go and watch it and it is a really great video I do lots of fun recipes in it it's actually a family picnic that we had during the summer so if you would love to go see that I would love for you to go watch it Yes, it's Christmas all around. So this time I actually did add in fresh cranberries. I have never added fresh cranberries in and I actually love how it tasted. All snow is falling down, all the colored lights lighting up this town. And as I walk outside, the Christmas choir sing Merry Christmas to you This time of year uh, Is a time to cheer Let our loved ones Our family And friends so now we are just getting started cleaning. My mom wanted to help me decorate and clean this time and so she is cleaning and entertaining Lucas while Andre and I are grabbing all the decor from the basement. Um, if you guys did not watch what we did on Halloween, I have a Halloween vlog and we actually redid our basement. We organized it and bought storage shelves and everything and I will also link that up in the top so if you would like to go watch that, it is a really good video. It just shows you how we did our basement and what we did for Halloween it's just a Halloween vlog and it's really fun so if you would love to go watch that it's a really great video and I'll have it up in the corner for you to go watch Friends, have a Christmas with so much love and with joy and laughter let us make Memories that stay forever It's Christmas today All snow is falling down All the colored lights lighting up this town And as I walk outside Hear the Christmas choir sing Merry Christmas to you
know how I was going to decorate this time again it was just like the Thanksgiving I really just went with it I did not know exactly what I wanted to do or how I was going to decorate it um, I'm okay with how it turned out it's not my favorite decor piece I really wanted to do a tablescape I've never done a tablescape kind of decor kind of thing um, and so I really wish we got like some like two or three beautiful garlands to make like a really pretty tablescape but this area is not really the best for it just because there's not a lot of room and we only have three chairs and a bench um, so it's not the greatest and it's not that big dining area so it's just best that I did what I did with it um, but one day I would love to do a huge tablescape they are so beautiful to me um, but I tried my best and it turned out okay. It's not my favorite, but I still think it's really pretty. You guys will have to let me know down in the comments what is your favorite decor piece throughout this video. Um, and then the next one I'll ask the same question. You guys will just have to let me know. Um, my favorite is still the um, tear tray. You guys will be seeing that a little bit later. I made my own video for that video um so you guys will see how i did my tiered tray um but that is my favorite decor piece so i really do enjoy it we're gonna dance we're gonna okay. dance 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 dance, Come on. dance we're gonna dance dance have a good time we're gonna dance dance all night long we're gonna dance have a good time, I think Santa's gonna come and join us in this song oh, yeah. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling tried to find all the pieces that I used on the websites. Um, some of them I've had from my baby shower. Um, some of them I've had over years of time like last year or my mom's had them for years. Um, and then other pieces I bought this year from Target, Walmart, Dollar Store. Um, and that's really all the places that I bought stuff from. 
um, but I will try to find everything on the websites and link it down below so if you are interested I will have all that stuff. the fridge um, I did stuff different this time I still use the kettle um, with like the fake floral inside of it but I did a little bit of a different thing this time around and I'm actually a big fan of how I did it um, I really like simple decor which is crazy because I want so much decor and just to layer it like crazy and make it just super pretty but I still like the simple parts of the decor I know it's really confusing you'll have to let me know down in the comments if you're like that as well like if you love being too extreme with your decor but you still like enjoy the simple parts because that's totally me but I love how it turned out it's super cute and like that dollar sign was five dollars at Target same with all the trees super cute and super cheap priced items and then like the garland that I was going to use I got them from the dollar store and the dollar store actually had some really cute items this time for Christmas I feel like they're starting to step their game up and I'm a big fan it's honestly cute stuff Would you come home? These are the days you shouldn't be
but this time I wanted to decorate on top of the cabinets. I really like how that looks in other houses. So I just wanted to step like the kitchen game up and just decorate on top of the cabinets. And so my mom was handing me the items while I was decorating up there and I used a lot of small trees. Some of them are from Target, some of them are from the dollar store, and then like the bells and pine cones. I've had for years, you guys should know by now that I love decorating with pine cones. I have like obsession with pine cone decor. It's really weird, but I just think pine cones make a difference. <laughs> it sounds crazy, like I don't know. Some of you guys might have like special things that you think look best than other things and mine are pine cones. I love the pine cones in my decor. It's just, it's so rustic-y and is that even a word, rustic-y? Well, that's what it is and it's just super, I don't know. It just looks cozy and it makes it more rustic and I just love how that looks. But I thought it was super fun decorating on top of the cabinets and I'm gonna keep doing that. I love it. <laughs> So I actually picked up two of these garlands. They are nine feet long for $5 at Target. And I wanted to get six of them for each of the windows in the living room and in the kitchen. But I only got two of them because they did sell out. Um, I thought it was just a really great deal. And I actually did a little haul and talked about these garlands on my Instagram story like last week before I decorated for this. So if you do not follow Our Little Bloom, that is my Instagram account. And I post so many cute photos of my family, my son. I write him cute messages. Now I'm starting to post decor because I kind of want like that cute decor themed profile with my family and all that stuff so if you do not follow our little bloom go follow that account i would love to have you there and you can stay up to date on all of my videos coming to you and just what we're doing it's super fun but i thought hanging up these garlands around the windows would just make it super cute and i think it turned out great we also dried some oranges you guys will be seeing that video later down the road so stay tuned for that video it is super fun and super cute um, but i did hang up some oranges and that made it even cuter Now 
now I am working on my pantry and as you guys know if you have seen my other decorate with me videos this part is the hardest and yes it's because I'm super short I have to step on a stepping stool and it's still hard for me to reach um, it's just it's difficult but the pantry decorating on top of it makes it feel so much better in the kitchen it just makes it feel so much more festive and more decorated and it's just super cute so I personally enjoy it and so does my mother um, so I decorate up there even though it cause, causes my ribs so much pain <laughs> it's all right I've been through it before with my child I can keep having pain on my ribs or whatever but it turned out really cute and I hope you guys enjoy seeing how it turned out it's really cute and you'll have to let me know still what is your favorite decor piece is it this because for a lot of people like Andre he loves the pantry decor he loves it every single time <laughs>
promise and to storm in the visit. No, he wouldn't miss this in Christmas times. You guys will have to let me know if the garlands look better with the oranges or not. I like it more with the oranges just because it was so much fun to make the oranges and it gives it a bit like a different texture. But you guys will have to let me know down in the comments. But I am going to end the video here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this part one decorate with me for Christmas. It was a lot of fun and honestly it took all day. This was a lot of decor to decorate with and it was just huge. So get ready for next year's Christmas because that's going to be bigger because I can't help myself from buying decor. I love it. It makes me happy. So yeah, but I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Get ready for part two on Friday this week. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really does help my channel. And it just makes me so happy to see that number grow because I know that there's more people who love my content and who want to be a little family with me. I will love to have you guys and I will see you guys next time. Christmas in my heart